Rules of the speed build, as usual, there's two of them. Number one, the time starts the moment the box is open, sealed, and two, I need to follow all the instructions in the instruction booklet, and that will stop the time. We'll talk about the set after the build. Let's go ahead and get started. are done and it took us one hour 19 minutes and two seconds let's go ahead and talk about this set now three things one value this set is 110 dollars and it comes with 960 something pieces so it's a bit under that general threshold of 10 pieces per dollar but it's pretty close so i'll give it that and then there's some unique pieces that probably be worth a little bit more like the the windshield it's a matte gold color uh, these custom printed pieces that are only in the set some of these cloud looking things they're probably worth a little more so i think it meets the value expectation and then in terms of build eh, nothing nothing crazy nothing special honestly uh this whole uh the rainbow rocket not the rocket the rocket itself i mean honestly the whole thing is pretty simple pretty straightforward nothing no crazy mechanics uh nothing was falling apart thankfully sometimes there's fragile builds and they get annoying to put together because you have to apply pressure there's one section that's kind of like that here but you could just take off the top put them instead and then put the top, top back on but honestly it wasn't a boring build and it wasn't annoying it wasn't frustrating or anything but it was very very average nothing special to it and finally the design the design itself i think i think it's it's cool first let me talk about the book so the book and the, the faces right here. I thought the faces, it says my friends with a PH cause Pharrell. And so this friends thing has Pharrell himself and then his wife, I assume. And then a bunch of other faces, which I thought they were modeling after a bunch of his friends like IRL or something. But in this book, which also real quick, this book has like some, the first three, four pages has a picture of him, a quote, sort of what inspired and the reason behind this they talk about how the ship is your limitless potential taking you anywhere you want to go this is the creativity that fuels that potential and then they clarified that this means that anybody can fit in the driver's seat so the two torsos of the figs they're identical and then there's the helmets and then so you're supposed to take off the head and then put whichever one looks closest to you or something and so i thought they were faces modeled after other uh other artists or other people that were influential to his life but it's just putting yourself in the sea which i guess it's cool but at the same time there wasn't one that looks like me so whatever no beard no glasses combination so but i do like the sort of color contrast because you have bright colors and then white down here and then the black and gold ship up here i do like like it's it's uh it's eye catching it's also with the rocket ship they did a solid black they never do solid black in any sort of ships or anything there's always accents of gray or white or some other stuff and i do like the solid black although the design of the shape itself it's kind of plain but i mean i guess what do you want but it, again it is a custom lego set he could have added some other stuff some input they could have changed it up a little bit but i do like the the cover the matte gold so overall it looks pretty nice one thing i mean you can just take these off 
but I feel like the wheels, they don't really, they don't really go. It's, it's a weird detail that I think they added. And then the rocket does come off. Like if you want to put the rocket, oh, but then this is weird. Okay. So I was going to say, if you want to put the rocket somewhere on your desk or something, but it has this giant back, which it could be interpreted as a thruster or something, but then you have this blue, which I feel like they should have. I don't know. I don't know. This, this is kind of weird. And then what do you do with this thing? And so, I mean, it does look nice right here, but maybe somebody just wants the rocket ship. So that little section could have been done better if they wanted to separate it because it does come off. And I did also want to talk about the box. The box I also think is really nice. It's, it's this matte black. You got the images in gloss. And I think just the way that they did the edges, because usually icons and other stuff, they'll have this Lego bar at the bottom, but this is just all one solid color. And I don't know, I think this is a cool box design. So overall, I probably put this set somewhere at a six or so. It's, it's cool enough, I guess, but it's nothing amazing. It's nothing crazy. The thing I would say is if you're a Lego collector or if you like Pharrell, I'd say go get this set because I don't think it's gonna, it's not gonna be reprinted for, they're not gonna make a second version of this or something. It's, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a limited time because it's also in response, not in response, but to build up his movie, his Lego movie. I think this would probably appreciate and value. But that's it for today's review. If you like the build, make sure you like and subscribe. Let me know what other sets I should build and review. And thanks for watching.